That's reverse. You're in reverse. <laughs> No. No. <laughs> it's a good way to warm it up. <laughs> and then there was one. Oh man, okay, so the BMW is gone. Um, it's gonna be a quick little update video. So basically, I got my inspection done. Yes, my RB20 passed. <laughs> they, didn't, they don't do um, emissions testing in New York though. But I did throw the stock seat back in just so that the guy doing my inspection wasn't like, oh, what the hell? Like, you know, I'm not gonna freaking, uh, you know, pass this thing. And also, my, my gauges aren't working, and they still passed me. I don't know if he was looking for that. But then also, I'm not sure if you guys could see it. Yeah, you can just see it. That That's a crack right there. But I just kept my windshield very dirty so that they didn't <laughs> they didn't notice the crack. Yeah, I know, I'm a hoodlum. But anyway. So yeah, I'm pumped about the inspection that I got done. Uh, I have the amp poking out right there. You can't really see it. Actually, yeah, you can. Oh, here comes some wind noise. But uh, anyway. I'm pretty bummed out with uh, Sonic Electronics right now because... Literally, they, they told me that they would be sending me my uh, my subwoofer enclosure for like the last two weeks, literally. And um, it still has not come in yet. But now it's saying uh, that the shipment is finally processing. And I've been on the phone with them a few times in the last two weeks. And they're like, oh yeah, it's shipping this date, shipping that date, blah, blah, blah. And it never shipped. Um, and it still hasn't shipped. But uh, anyway, just want to show you guys the uh, wooden, you know, I guess you could call it like a, like a trunk, trunk floor, I don't even know. But anyway, I, I put that in. Um, I had to cut the uh, that little corner off just so I could fit it in the car. I didn't take that in, into uh, consideration when I was building this thing. But yeah, for now it's not strapped, it's not uh, strapped in or bolted down or anything like that. I don't hear it vibrating as I'm driving. So I think I might just leave it as is. Sorry, I had the camera pointed at the plain carpet for a second there. But, uh, yeah, the carpet's pretty ruined from me having it all bunched up underneath the seat, but oh well. <laughs> but yeah, a lot of people were like, why are you reusing your car, blah, blah, blah. Um, I think if I had, like, 245s on there, then, uh, you know, it wouldn't be as bad. But since these are pretty... These are pretty wide tires for my wheels. These are nines and I have 255s on there. But, um, yeah, <clears throat> it was just rubbing too much. So I raised it. This side is actually higher than the other side, even though I set both coilovers to the exact same height. Yeah, see that one's lower. And look at how gross these wheels are. Hold on. Let me see if I can find any of the oxidation and, like, just freaking corrosion going on. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. It's too dark. But anyway, long story short, these wheels are gross. <laughs> they look good from afar, but then when they're up front, up in front of you, they're far from good. Oh, yeah. Here's a good spot. Right there. All coming off. Oh well, I don't even really care. <clears throat> but yeah, I still need to take care of this bumper. I'm really lazy. And uh, 
I don't know, taking off the bumper and putting it back on is such a pain, so I guess I'll just have to get to it when I have a whole weekend off, because I've been back at work and just, you know, getting everyone's bikes ready for spring. I work at a bike shop, in case you guys didn't know that already. But yeah, that's just a little update. I'll be sure to make another video once the uh, subwoofer enclosure comes in. I could have easily just gotten like some crappy Best Buy 10 inch uh, closed off subwoofer box, but I got like this, um, I got this ported box that's made for the specifics of my sub, just so it sounds as good as it could. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, I know this was kind of a crappy little update, but uh, look out for more videos to come. Thanks for watching, see ya.